Welcome to our honest review of the Guayamina Princess, an old favourite of let's go to Tenerife.co.uk. The hotel underwent a complete refurbishment in 2018, taking almost nine months to complete. The new reception area oozes quality and gives a reassuring boutique hotel first impression. Check-in was completed with a minimum of fuss and with a very warm welcome from the genuinely friendly staff. You can opt for the platinum upgrade which adds a little more luxury in terms of the room, dining options and extra facilities. This review is for the standard option which we found to be absolutely excellent. The communal areas are, as you would expect, in tip-top condition and very well maintained. The bathroom facilities are excellent, with a razor point, a hairdryer, shaving mirror and a full range of his and her toiletries, uh, changed every day. The walk-in rain shower was superb. Instant hot water with easy to use, variable temperature controls. You are also provided with tea and coffee making facilities. You get the original contents of the minibar for free and then you pay for any top-ups you might want. The flat screen TV has a number of British and international channels. The beds were particularly comfortable. There's a small seating area and the housekeeping does a great job on a daily basis. One of the main plus points of the Guaymina Princess is its absolutely superb location right out on the beach promenade. The side sea view balcony has excellent views over Torbiscus Beach. The glass lifts will take you down to the restaurants which are situated on the floor below the main reception areas. The main restaurant is the food market and is a buffet selection. Shorts are allowed for breakfast but long trousers must be worn for the evening meals. Food in general is excellent. The variety of food on offer at the Guayamina is enough to satisfy the most discerning palate. You have also an opportunity to dine at the Roast restaurant which is a la carte, one visit per four day stay and you need to book at least 24 hours in advance. This restaurant has an emphasis on meat and the food is well above average. After breakfast, why not take a casual stroll down to one of the outdoor pools that overlooks Torbiscus Beach. If you feel up to a spot of mild exercise, then there's a choice of Pilates or yoga. For the more energetic amongst us, you could try the pool gymnastics. Or if you prefer the beach, then there's a gateway from the hotel onto the beach promenade and the beach and the bars are just seconds away. It's just a short walk away from Puerto Colón Beach and Harbour where you'll find numerous boat trips on offer to see the whales and the dolphins. Of course, if you prefer just to sit and people watch, there's a good range of bars and restaurants to sit and admire the many street artists on offer. If you like live music, then the Champions Bar is right in front of the hotel and every afternoon, Monday to Friday, from 2 to 4, features the wonderful Gary J. At least I will die free. 
The evenings at the hotel have a great atmosphere. You can either relax in one of the many hotel bars or enjoy the evening's entertainment, which includes some of the island's best tribute acts. The prices of drinks at the Guayamina are not as cheap as they are on the seafront, but for a four-star hotel, they are not excessive by any means. So, would we recommend the hotel? Absolutely. There were no negatives at all during our stay. The location, you've got a frontline position. The staff, everybody walks around with a smile. The food is of high quality and great variety. There are some superb value offers on direct from the hotel. And the comfort and cleanliness are excellent. Spotlessly clean, great beds. The atmosphere is relaxed, unpretentious and fun. So enjoy your next trip to the Guayamina Princess. We hope you've enjoyed our review of the Guayamina Princess. Please like and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more Tenerife hotel reviews. And check out our website for our top five hotel and restaurant picks in Costa Deque, Playa Las Americas, Los Cristianos and Golf del Sur. Many, many thanks for watching.